Hello everyone, welcome again. It is my second tutorial of uh, Core, Core Java. So in the first tutorial, we seen uh, how to create an environment and uh, for a Java program and how to set a path uh, for uh, JDK and uh, how to. Uh, in the last tutorial, we simply type this code and uh, print a message on our uh, command prompt window. Okay. Uh, my name is Bao and uh, <coughs> in this tutorial uh, it is time to know how what is a class and what is a public static void man and string or ARGS all the things for that uh, I am preparing uh, I am preparing notes uh, for you guys ok let's see uh, requirements for a hello java program as uh, our last program is a simply a message print program so uh, assume that my uh, message is hello so firstly install the JDK and uh, and uh, set the path and all thing then uh, we simply um, type this uh, program and uh, for compile uh, the code we use uh, command from Java C and for execute the code uh, or run the code we use Java and simply uh, program name ok and then next ok now time to what is a class class is a keyword that they used to declare a class in java it's a simply a keyword that is uh, used to declare a class in java and public public is a public is an uh, access modifier it is also a keyword and uh, it is uh, used to visibility of uh, all like uh, um, what is the scope uh, what is the scope of uh, my method and scope of my keyword and my variable as I, um, I guess uh, there is a uh, four types of modifier in a Java public, uh, public, uh, protected, and uh, default. We will discuss in our next uh, tutorials. Okay, next thing is static. Static is also keyword. When I declare any method as a static, so I can call it directly without object. Okay, no need to create an object. Uh, okay if uh, as uh, we can see in our code <coughs> our main method is um, our main method is uh, static okay so uh, main method is called by jvm okay Ex main method is executed by jvm java virtual machine and uh, so it is a static method so don't need to create an object of main method it's uh, called directly by jvm next is a void void is a simply return type it's a mean the main method or uh, our method is not written it uh, method is written nothing okay it doesn't return any value and next is a main main represent the start of a program uh, main is a uh, for java main is a entry point of uh, uh, java code firstly it is a uh, Okay, and next is string ARGS. Okay, a string is a is used to command line arguments. We will learn. We will learn it later. Okay, uh, when we discuss about the variables and data types, uh, then uh, we and arrays we uh, we discuss uh, about the strings ARGS also. And system dot out dot print ln it is a simply a statement for printing a message and um, printing a message okay as uh, we use in a c like print f the simply is a output function and next how many best can we write a program in uh, java okay we can change the um, position of uh, our main methods uh, argument like this public static void main string args is valid public static void main string uh, space array args is valid public static void main string space args array is valid and uh, after a string three dots args also valid it is um, by barracks after the uh, it is introduced by the barracks barracks is a concept that uh, introduced in java after the 1.4 uh, um, jdk uh, in a 1.5 or 1.6 jdk and uh, 
these all are valid <coughs> and the what is the invalid uh, with a uh, main method public static void main string array space args uh, is a uh, invalid because we are not use here uh, static okay public void main also uh, sorry static void main also valid because here not to use uh, uh, access modifier like public public void static main also uh, invalid because we interchange the position of main and static so these are uh, we can not use with a main method and this thing we can use the in a main method we can um, we can interchange the position of uh, args and arrays and one more thing uh, one more thing that uh, we can also use as a in the position of our args anything as you want x y z you want because it is a simply an argument and uh, you can give uh, as you want okay in the next tutorial we will see our next uh, program and uh, uh, I think uh, we will discuss about the data types in Java and uh, for uh, if you like please subscribe and uh, if you want uh, this notes uh, uh, as a soft copy you can comment uh, you can comment and um, uh, provide me your email ID uh, email IDs I will provide you as a soft copy and uh, thank you so much and uh, keep continue watching thank you if you like please subscribe please subscribe don't forget to subscribe click on the subscribe button